Yo guys, welcome back to my channel. Today, now we are here in Kanyakumari district. We are heading to a place called Matur. To Matur. Okay. So there's no option. I have to take a walk. And now I'm heading to the Matur. This doesn't seem like a September. It's too hot. Misunderstood Kanyakumari. It is in Kerala. It's not a. You know, this place it's quite different oh, from Kerala. It's, you know, this here. Kanyakumari it's located right next nice to the view. Kerala. This Kanyakumari district right. has a little bit of difference as when comparing Kerala. So here it is. Uh, so still a few more meters to go. Almost uh, we have reached to the destination. Okay, this way. You know, uh, almost we are here. Yeah, still. You know, uh, I've been walking around the streets for more than 30 minutes. Finally, we are here in the destination. Now we are here near the Matur bridge, right in front of us. Okay, let me tell you the whole thing about how I came here. First of all, I... Uh, I came to Kanyakumari and uh, I went to a bus station ah, called the Vadasiri bus station. This is called from there Matur I took a bus, Tartipalam. I borrowed a bus from there and I got down at uh, hey. Thiruvallaru. Thiruva Water flow in here. After getting down at uh, Thiruvallaru, I just came here by walk. I couldn't find nice any tuk-tuk to uh, to drivers or tuk-tuks there. So Still I just we, took a walk uh, from that a place. A long way to go. Look at that, look at the surroundings, look at the atmosphere. It's totally nice, totally mesmerizing. You know, the nature blended with hills. Extraordinary. The view from here is nice, unbelievable. Matur! This place is stunning. Uh, the atmosphere surrounded with uh, hills uh, getting a positive uh, peaceful vibe look there is a hill right there and the place is surrounded with nature let's take a look down if you want to come and visit this place you have to ah. come to Kanyakumari uh, just come to Kanyakumari and ask a few people or check the Google map. Oh, nice bridge. These two will guide you. People will guide you and the Google Maps will guide you as well. Uh, go to Vadasiri bus station and take a bus from there. You can ask the bus conductor about the details and about this place. Uh, they'll guide you. Alright, uh, let's uh, talk about the history of this place. This, uh, this Matur hanging bridge, it's, it's the largest bridge in India and uh, seemingly it's uh, one of the largest br ha hanging, hanging bridges in Asia as well and also this, uh, this bridge was mainly constructed for irrigation and uh, agricultural purposes. You know, during uh, 1960s, uh, exactly in 1966, during uh, the rule of Mr. Kamraj, during his government, this bridge was constructed, and the total budget, uh, the total cost for the construction of this bridge was uh, approximately around 1.2 million, uh, which means uh, when it comes to Indian currency, the value is uh, totally 12 lakhs. From here, during the night. Down right there, there is a. In 1966, the small government spent river going this much that way. money to construct this bridge for the agricultural purpose. The main purpose is to take water from that hill to this hill to carry water. That's the main purpose for the agricultural Stunning purpose. Stunning, marvelous uh, place to take photographs. You know, uh, this one is really wonderful in Tamil Nadu. When it comes to Tamil Nadu, I haven't seen any bridges like this in this setup. And also, you can see a uh, lot Let's of the greenish scenery around this bridge. Nice place to spend some time, nice it's place to take photographs to and videos, nice place for vlogging as well. 
So there are so many things. Yeah, uh, as you can see, yeah, uh, on the left yeah. side, you can see a small, you can see a trough uh, which uh, stretches uh, about one, nearly Careful. one kilometer. The total length of the bridge is approximately Still one kilometer, as you can see, to that yeah. end. Uh, this bridge comes from here Way. and connects straight i think they're there you know the this bridge connects the two hills together and this uh the main purpose is as i said earlier uh is to bring the water from the one point to another point from this bridge to that bridge as you can see the trough on the left side filled with water this water is going from that hill behind me to the, the hill, the hill which is right in front of me, straight over there. We have come See, this far there to here. This water is being transferred from that place to the another end, to the another hill. The main purpose of this is uh, irrigation. You know, uh, during that period of time, it's really impossible to, to carry the water from one place to another place. That's why the government made this decision and they made a good plan and they, and they implemented this plan. They constructed this hanging bridge to transfer the water from one hill to another hill for agricultural purposes. You know, uh, from this side to that side, you know, carrying and transferring the water, it will help uh, for the irrigation and for the agriculture in these areas. So transferring the water from one hill to another hill, it will uh, contribute a lot for the agri agriculture and the irrigation things. I'll show you the place where this uh, where this trough connects to a small river. There it is. Here we go. This is the end of the bridge. The trough connects here. The trough starting from that hill and, and stretches uh, about one kilometer and it connects here from one end to the another end. This is a nice you know, innovative so thing uh, to transfer to water from that, that end to this end uh, for agricultural so purposes. Nice innovation by the government. Uh, okay, during 1960s, uh, this, was, this, uh, this thing, this must be a big deal during that period of time. Okay, uh, I'm at the restaurant guys from Badas area, I boarded, boarded a bus and I got down at uh, Thiruvayaru. Here I'm gonna satisfy my hunger. I ordered parotta and beef. Parotta and beef. Okay, uh, let's finish the breakfast here. And uh, next, I love this combination basically. Uh, if you come to Kerala or Kanyakumari taste this, you'll find it interesting. I'm gonna eat parotta uh, with beef curry. So this is going to be super duper amazing. I love this uh, combination. Yeah, it's available uh, in Kanyakumari right, uh, and Kerala. Parotta if you, beef combination. If you come to Kanyakumari or Kerala, try this combination. If you are watching my channel for the first time, subscribe my channel, subscribe, and uh, click the bell button for more exciting videos. Uh, stay tuned. And uh, you you can also tell me your you can also tell the opinion about this video. You can comment in the comment section below. Okay. Okay. If you like this video, just hit the like button. Also, press the bell icon to receive notifications. Uh, subscribe my channel as well. Support me. And. Uh, Okay, tell me the opinion about this video, comment in the comment section, like, share, subscribe guys, okay, 
stay tuned for another video very soon i'll meet you in another video until then bye bye this is your elden's wake